Good morning, everybody. Time is 741. We're always trying to find ways to squeeze in extra nutrients. Here to help us is the beautiful Suma, your dietitian. Yes. And I love these ideas because they're easy to do and no one's the wiser, including kids like you have two, right? I have two kids. And okay. you know, it is a challenge to get everyone to eat well, but it's all about making small changes that, that are going to have a big impact in the end. Let's get going with okay. this. Three different kinds of rice. Right. Up here you have? White rice brown rice and then this is the hottest new super grain it's called Kavina Nuda which is a naked oat it's also called rice of the prairies because it's grown in the prairies it's grown in Canada so what makes it so much better this okay, Kavina well, get Nuda. this it has nine times more fiber than white rice seven times more iron than white rice wow. and two and a half more time two and a half times more protein than white rice so it cooks just like rice it has a sort of a nutty flavor to it and it's a whole grain so you know change it up a bit and give it a try so it keeps you full longer which is awesome yeah now over here these eggs look Look the same. Look the same, taste the same, smell the same, all of that, except that this egg has three times more vitamin D than a regular egg. Okay. So, and the difference is that the hens are fed a special feed that's enriched with vitamin D. And so the eggs then become an excellent source of vitamin D. And we don't get enough vitamin D because we have such long winters and it yeah. gets dark real quick Especially for a long from time. October to March, you know, we really need to get vitamin D and including vitamin D rich foods, we probably should take a vitamin D supplement too. Okay, an apple a day keeps the doctor away, but it all also is great in terms of nutrition, fiber, rather than drinking it. How come? Absolutely. Leave the skins on because the fiber in one apple is equivalent to the fiber in five cups of apple juice. Wow. So, and think of the calories, 70 calories versus 600. What are you going to choose, right. right? So, and salmon versus tuna, both are great in terms of protein, but salmon has more omega-3 fats than the tuna. So, so that's you want the omega-3s for? Well, it's good for mood, it's good for inflammation or anti-inflammatory, anti and it's also good because it's got uh, vitamin D, you know, omega-3s and, um, and vitamin D are found in the salmon. Okay, now this is interesting. You keep hearing about different things with oils, what to use, what to yeah. cook with, what to cook with at high temperatures. Yeah, yeah, Your yeah. new favorite is? Avocado oil. Who knew it existed? Yeah, now I love canola oil. Canola oil. I still cook with it. Um, but the latest oil on the market is avocado oil, which is fabulous. It's got lutein, which is that antioxidant for, for the eyes. eyes. Helps prevent age-related macular degeneration. Okay, so you can cook with this at high temps as well as just pour it on top of a salad or Absolutely, whatever. Absolutely, I do both. Yeah, and it tastes great. Okay, and last but not least, you're thinking about something quick. Yeah. It's lunchtime at work. You yeah. go for what's convenient. Usually ends up in a styrofoam Usually tray like that. Usually ends up in a styrofoam tray, like a greasy yeah. tray chow mein, no vegetables at all, high sodium, really greasy. So do some planning ahead of time. Make the healthy choice. Keep some healthy choice gourmet steamers in your freezer, right? You can get the um, ravioli and chicken florentine, or you can have the grilled basil chicken, which is one of my favorites. It's steamed, so it locks in the nutrition. No preservatives. You're getting some veggies. You're getting some whole grains. And it comes in so many different flavors and options. So yeah, what do you have here? You have uh, grilled basil chicken, yeah, ravioli nice chicken. It looks, it's very appetizing, and it's satisfying. Is fine. The whole thing too is you say whenever you're eating a carb, mix it with a protein. Right. How come? Well that slows down the absorption and the digestion of the carbohydrate plus the protein also helps you feel fuller faster. Okay and that's what we all want. For more information everybody facebook.com slash healthy choices slash Canada. Take the healthy choice pledge. It can be that easy. Thank you so much to Good Health. Right now over to Ken Frankish in the newsroom.